Now, I've been lucky and was able to spend years of my life in Germany, and during that time, I made sure to live with people who spoke little or no English to make total immersion, something from which I could not escape. But I didn't have the luxury of living in China when I first started learning that language, and it was absolutely not necessary. In fact, after less than three months of studying the language, my time in the country was so distracting, I didn't have time to study it while I was there at all, or very little. And that is typically what happens when you try to combine tourism with immersion. So instead, use these tips that we've talked about today to create some effective systems that will place you in the company of your target language each and every week, or at least a great percentage of it. Then when you do get to travel, you can relax and focus on speaking and understanding as you move around. And you'll have earned that rather than trying to interrupt your time there by learning all the time.